you got some problems, we'll be there to solve them. We're a squad who can do the job. We're the squad who can do the job. The monster is in trouble. Feed them on the double. We're the squad who can do the job. We're the squad who can do the job. The monster mask squad. Terrific, horribly horrific Monster Mat Squad! Monster Cake Mistake! There you go. <laughs> what you making? It's a paper airplane, Monster Max. See? I just take this triangle and fold it in half like this, and see? A paper. <laughs> <laughs> Really well. I noticed. <laughs> and the scream screen always surprises Goo. The scream screen! Oh, somewhere in Monstrovia, there's a monster in need. And whenever a monster needs our care, the monster mascot will be there. It's Miss Merkley. She bakes monster muffins and cakes in her muffin shop. Hi, Miss Merkley. Hi, Monster Math Squad. I've made a big cake mistake. What happened, Miss Merkley? The Monster Twins placed an order today. You mean even Stevie and even Evie? Yes, but I made a mistake that has completely ruined everything. Can you help? The Monster Math Squad is on the way. Hmm, <laughs> we need to help Miss Merkley fix the big mistake she made with the Monster Twins cake order. <gasps> I bet we can use Monster Math for that. Yeah, Monster Math can do anything. Because Monster Math is everywhere. Hey, will you join the Monster Math squad on the job? Join the squad, join the squad. You will? Awesome. First, we need the secret Monster Math word that will help us get the job done. Ah! Ah! Word Monster. Monster. Today's secret Monster Math word is Symmetric. Next time you see Word Monster and hear him squawk, shout out the secret monster math word with us to make something math amazing happen. Symmetric! <laughs> Not yet, Goo. Wait until you see Word Monster again. <sighs> Waiting's hard. Come on, Monster Math Squad. Let's go help Miss Merkley fix her big cake mistake. <laughs> Monster Math Squad. Huh? Are those your famous crusty carrot cakes? Yes. I was about to decorate them when I realized my mistake. I love the fun shapes you're baking them in. The shapes are the problem. Why? Listen to the order and you'll see. Dear Miss Merkley, please bake us crusty carrot cakes in different shapes. But that's what you did. Yes. And then I realized. It's even Stevie and even Evie who want them. Everything for them has to be exactly the same. What's the problem? There are two for even Stevie and two for even Evie. That's even. <laughs> That's the same. Hmm. But do they look the same? What do you think, squad? No, none of these cakes are the same shape. And that means the twins won't want any of them. Why don't you just make another set of four cakes just like these? And the twins will be happy. I can't make any more cakes. I've used up all my ingredients. That is a problem. How are we going to get two sets of cake shapes that are the same out of these four cakes? Ah! Ah! Did you see Word Monster? That means we all need to shout the secret monster math word, symmetric. Are you ready? Let's shout it together on three. One, two, three, symmetric. Look, it worked, a monster math monitor. This snow monster has two weeds she wants to decorate the same, but the paper circles are all different. That's the way they came. How can she make two matching sets? She has a great trick. 
It's easy because you see, circles are symmetric. She folds a circle down the middle very carefully. The line the fold makes is called the line of symmetry. Then she tears the circle on the line, and what do you know? She's got two matching ornaments, all ready to go. When a shape is symmetric, both sides are the same in every way. So when all the circles are folded and torn, the sets match. Hooray! Thanks, Monster Mouse Monitor. Now we know all about symmetric. If you have a symmetric shape, like a circle, you can get two new identical shapes out of it. And since symmetric is a math word, let's, let's do, do monster math! math. Oh! I see a circle. Great! If we cut it down its line of symmetry, we'll have a set of two matching cakes. How do we find its line of symmetry? We can't fold a cake down the middle like the paper circles the monster math monitor showed us. No, you certainly can't. But I never make a cake without giving it a matching paper doily. Maybe you can use that somehow? Thanks, Miss Merkley. <laughs> if we fold the paper doily in half right down the middle, we'll find its line of symmetry. Here goes. I fold it in half. I open it up. And there's the line of symmetry, with both sides the same on each side of the line. Just place the doily on the cake, and I'll cut along the line of symmetry. Ooh. Now we've got a set of two matching cakes. Perfect for even Stevie and even Evie. Uh, too bad the rest of the cakes aren't circles. This one's a heart shape. Maybe it's symmetric too. Will you help us check? Monster math horrific. Okay, I take the doily, fold it in half, open it up. <gasps> A perfect line of symmetry! Are both sides the same? They are! That means... A heart shape is a symmetric shape! Place the doily on the cake, Lily, and I'll cut along the line of symmetry. Wow! Now we've got another set of matching cakes for even Stevie and even Evie. What about this one? What shape is it? A triangle. Let's see if it's a symmetric shape. Hmm. I can't figure out where the line of symmetry is on this doily. The shapes on each side of this line are definitely not the same. Does that mean this triangle shape is not symmetric? No, oh, what do we do now? Ah! Ah! Did you see word monster? Then let's shout the secret monster math word, symmetric. Together again on three. Ready? One, two, three. Symmetric! Look, a monster math monitor. The snow monster wants to hang paper moons on both her weeds to make them look pretty. But she only has one moon. She needs to find the line of symmetry. She tries to fold it in half, but that looks lame. It isn't symmetric. The sides don't look the same. The snow monster wonders, on closer inspection, if maybe the line of symmetry runs in another direction. Not up and down, but maybe across the middle. This shape is symmetric. She has solved the moon-shaped riddle. <laughs> Thanks, Math Monitor. Now we know that some shapes have a line of symmetry that runs down the middle. And some shapes have a line of symmetry that runs across them. Let's try folding this triangle across the middle and see what happens. Is it symmetric? Are the sides the same now? Yes, it worked! Okay, Max, put it on the cake. And I'll cut it. Another set of matching cakes. Now, for this one... Nope, that's not symmetric. I'll fold it the other way. Nope, the two 
two sides still aren't the same. It doesn't work for the L shape. I guess that means that some shapes aren't symmetric. If it's not symmetric, we can't use it. Oh, we've got to hurry and get these decorated. Even Stevie and even Evie will be here soon. Wow, these crusty carrot cakes are perfect. Thanks, Miss Merkley. We'll take them all. Except that one. Since we can't both have one of those, it, it wouldn't, wouldn't be even. even. Yeah! <laughs> Go ahead. You monsters deserve a massive monster treat. Uh, the pieces aren't the same. One piece is bigger than the other. I should have the biggest piece, Goo, because I'm the biggest monster. I should have the biggest piece, Max, because I'm the... the, the greenest monster. Yeah! <laughs> I know what to do. <laughs> oh, hey, Lily! <laughs> This looks symmetric. There, now your pieces are the same. Monster matherific job, Monster Math Squad. We helped Miss Merkley fix her mistake with the Monster Twins cake order. And we did it by knowing all about symmetric. That deserves a great big monster howl on three. One, two, three. Howl! We, we did, did the math! math.